Hey guys, it's Ghosty Gaming here today. Today we're going to be showing you how to install the Euro Truck Simulator 2 multiplayer and the American Truck Simulator multiplayer. It's actually the website is called truckersmp.com and, and also if you do this you're doing it at your own risk. Um, I've done one of these videos a long time ago. Recently they have changed the website and American Truck Simulator has come out. Um, so so basically you've got to do it at your own risk really so if anything goes wrong it's not my fault but there is one thing I can um, if it goes wrong I will show you now before we install it um, in your documents in your attraction mode too you will find out that sometimes your jobs won't load so in your profile file and folder in the config make sure you're opening it in notepad on windows um, 7 and then you have to go in properties and change and then do it and it came up something different like this um, but in Windows 10 it comes up straight away but I'm gonna make it come up now like this and you make sure you're opening it in notepad notepad will be down here in the first place but mine's in notepad at the top there and you open the configuration file and change this to one save it and open your direct similar to um, when it opens up make sure all your jobs are there and then when you hit it just put that back to zero and then uh, open the Euro Truck Simulator 2 multiplayer and it should be all working properly. That's the same for American Truck Simulator, except from in your documents it would be American, not Euro Truck Simulator. So now I'll show you how to install Truckers MP. <coughs> what I'm doing, I open <coughs> Google and then I go to <coughs> Truckers MP in the first link and then go to, well, I'm already logged in but that's my log out and press login again because um, you want me logged in for the very first time you install it um, you've got to put your email and password in so I'm just going to do that now then you'll come up with this page um, also if you've never signed, um, never been on here before you need, will need to um, when you press login it will ask you to, if you've got an account you have to click here to create an account and it will ask you to authorise through Steam I'm, not, I'm just going to show you a bit let me show you and then you've got to put your Steam password and thing in I want to see if it comes up with anything for me. I've already authorised it once already. I want to see if it can let me do it again so I can show you how to do it. Right, it's an app. She asked me to um, have to do the Steam Guard stuff. So, because of this, I'm just going to um, at least log into my email quickly and see if I can just show how you how it, it will you'll get, been, you'll get sent an email to your main email account when you do this. Where your Steam account is set up to if you've got the Steam Guard stuff on, as I have. Um, I've got to log into my email to get the um, thing from Steam support. Um, I see a bit now, it shows me now. Um, I'm going to enter my code now. Um, submit. Shoot it, let me see if it will. Let me show how you do this bit. Choose Steam. I think. Here we go. Right, my script is really authorised with them before, so I can't do nothing about that. I can just I can just log in now and continue how we were. So after you've done that, you just gotta log back in to your account that may or may not have logged itself in, I don't know. Then you need to press download now. Um as a member, if it gives you a virus, not my fault, basically I'm just giving you the link how you download it from the Truckers MP website. I've also done it before, so people have done it. Um it says supports um, 64-bit version. I don't know if it's a 32 this version as well. I'm not sure. Um, also, would follow the rules so you get banned off the server. Uh, also, you just got to boot it. Click Truck is on P. And then click yes. Then click OK. Then you click next. Now you've got to set the terms and conditions. Next and next again. If you're doing American, it allows you for the American one, but I'm only doing your track, then you've got to find this directory. So I'll show you how you get it. From here, it goes to the C drive and to your program files or program files x86. x86 means 64 bit, and that's 32. Um, go down to Steam, then go down to Steam apps, then find, then common, then find your game, so Euro Truck Simulator 2 or American Truck Simulator. For mine, it's Euro Truck Simulator, and I will click OK. Then next. Then next again and create a new desktop icon and then it will extract the files and get it already onto your desktop for you. Then you click finish and you can play the game basically. Um, 
I hope you like this video today guys so please rate comment and subscribe for more videos goodbye